Well, hello there. This is Bakari Shivana with Mac Automation Tips. Hey, I'm back with another video about Amazing Marvin. In this particular video, I'm going to talk about a strategy called Top of Mind that will help you stay focused on what you planned for today. So stick around and check it out. So yes, you know I'm, I'm really in love with Amazing Marvin and there is so much to show you and I can probably produce 25 or 30 videos around what's in Amazing Marvin and I wanted to focus on one that's one of my most important features to me is one that I think if it ever stopped working I would just probably be so disappointed and this is called Top of Mind and basically what it does is is it helps you to stay on track of the task that you plan for today, right? And what it does is it shows you like an external window outside of Marvin and it tells you, you know, your next task. So we'll go over the settings a little bit more in a minute, but basically, you know, your settings here as you go in and you want to talk about, you wanted to show the next task for today, right? For the current day that you're working in. So let me show you how it looks. We'll click out of the settings, I mean, out of the uh, strategy part here. So this is where the strategy is found in the strategy section. And you, as you know from my previous videos that uh, about the Marvin strategy, there's over like 90 strategies in Amazing Marvin. So uh, top of mind is just one of them. So anyway, if we go here to my present day, I have, um, you know, three, four ta uh, tasks here, one project and some tasks at the top. Now, normally, when I come in the morning, I'll have these tasks uh, in this section. They usually be about, the, you know, 10 minutes to 20 minute tasks that I just want to get off and get done so I can move on to more deep work type tasks like projects, client work, and have, what have you. So, basically, when I click outside of Marvin, you'll see this little window here, this little window right here, is reflection of this first uh, task for the morning, right? And basically, that window will stay open uh, as long as I'm outside of Marvin. And what it's doing is it's reminding me this is what the task I'm supposed to work on. Now, it has some little buttons here to, like, you, know, you can click when the task is done. I can also track the time of it. And I also can click click the uh, procrastination wizard, which is a little more detail about that. So don't worry about that one. And then I can also open Marvin when it's closed. So the beauty of this is I, I can go through a set of tasks and not have to keep opening Marvin in order to click them done. And also if I veer off into something like, you know, I start on a task, but I kind of get off on a tangent and start doing something else. Mar that's little, this little window here is showing me what task is uh, I'm supposed to be working on. That right there is, for me, the most important thing about Marvin. And um, it, it's some mornings I get in here and I just get through a lot of different, I'll get through three or four or five tasks easily because of this one little feature. And so uh, it really works really well. Um, now, when it gets down to, say, projects in here, the projects you, you normally have, you have a lot of different tasks in here. So you see I have these different subtasks inside the project. So basically, if I were, let me kind of um, click these off, right? And you see I get some points there for getting this completed. All right, now when I go back outside of Marvin, it'll just say, you know, produce a YouTube video because it's showing this um as a project, see, so a project's a little bit different. But now if I come into here and show these and say I'm supposed to be doing recording video, which I'm doing right now, and if I wanted to click the track time, right, if I do that and I go back out, you'll see that now the top of mind recognizes the task that I'm focused on um, in that project. Okay, so I hope that makes sense, right? So that's how that's one way you can look at that. Now I want to pause this or stop tracking. All right, we're going to go back to our project again. Okay, now there's another little feature called Super Focus, which is another strategy that you enable inside of Marvin. And if I enable that, basically what that does is that it will just focus on this particular um, task. And when I, again, when I go outside, 
it will, you know, show the, in the external window. Now, when I click that done, which I don't want to do that right now because I want to get points for it. So I'm going to work in this. Well, I, I can go ahead and do it. So I'm going to click this, click this. this well, I'm, let me do it outside of here. So I click it done here. Okay. And then notice that it goes to the next, um, it goes to the next task. Now, here though, the, it goes to the next task and then you see that the external um, window says, you know, edit video. So that's the next task, which is I'm going to do after I finish this video, finish this recording. So that's called, you know, uh, the, the, the focus kind of super focus is when you really want to just kind of get through a series of tasks in a project or a series of tasks in, in on your day um, day view. That's what you do. Right. And so one of the keys to this is that you if you really want to use this this top of mind in, in, in a productive way, you want to have your tasks in a sequential order in which you want to do them. So, you know, Marvin has a lot of different ways that you can categorize uh, your tasks, but you want to whatever whatever strategy you use for that. And it, and it has some custom strategies It has one called morning afternoon and evening uh, ca uh, 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 category, you know, you'll, you'll find out about that when you start getting into Amazing Marvin. Basically, but you want to make sure that you organize those tasks in the order that you want. And then when you use top of mind, um, then, you know, it'll present that way. So again, if this is something you think you're interested in, definitely give it a try because you can get a 30 day um, trial of Amazing Marvin. And I've done a video about how to get started with Amazing, Amazing Marvin. And if you are kind of like considering or rethinking the present task manager that you have, task manager that you have, or it's not working for you that well, then give this a try. Amazing Marvin is a little bit, you know, you can very easily use it um, straight forward out the box, but it has so many features. It does take time to understand and use them, but I think it's worth the time. And quite frankly, I will probably never switch from Amazing Marvin for a, for a long time, if, if ever. I mean, it just really works for me. So I hope you enjoy this video. If you have any questions, uh, definitely give me some comments in the comment section. And if you like this video, please like it. And also, if you're not a subscriber, please subscribe. Thanks a lot.